This week the semi-finalists of the BBC dance competition took to the dance floor to try and earn a place in the Strictly final. With the bar being raised as each couple had to learn two routines, the pressure was on. Although one contestant blew the judges away. Sunday night saw the five celebrities in the competition do all they can to try and get through to the upcoming finals. Being tasked with learning two routines, as opposed to just one, 22-year-old Molly Reinford tackled the Paso Doble and American Smooth with her professional partner Carlos Gu. Impressing the four judges, the young star was given a total combined score of 75 after getting 36 and 39 for her performances. Putting her in second place on the leaderboard, one point behind Hamza Yassin, body language expert Dan Stanton believes the CBBC star has upped her game. Tired, repetitive and overhyped, BBC viewers call for Strictly to be axed after 20 years Strictly Come Dancing first began in May 2004 and has seen many celebrity faces take to the dance floor for a chance to win the iconic glitter ball trophy. However now BBC viewers have called for the competition to be cancelled after 20 years, calling the show tired and repetitive. Speaking on behalf of Betfair, he commented, this week Strictly was a real game changer for a lot of the celebrities. At this point in the competition, the stakes have never been higher and levels are all very tight. The body expert added that during the routines in the final, each celebrity will have to make sure their performances are completely seamless with no technical mistakes, Dan continued, Molly, who I believed was potentially in the danger zone, was given some incredible feedback and scores over the weekend. Despite being in the bottom two recently, she was highly praised and seemed to perform seamlessly, even receiving positive comments from Craig. She was told it was one of her best performances in the show to date, which proves she has definitely upped her game. She has certainly turned it around after receiving some negatives and nearly been voted off several times by the public. Dan highlighted that Molly and Carlos had a deep level of rapport between them which added to their seamless routines that earned them such high praise. Dot Molly hasn't had an easy journey during her time on Strictly as she's found herself in the dance-off multiple times. Similarly, Floriste is another contestant who has secured a spot in the final after being in the bottom two on many occasions, including the semi-final. The former X Factor star is at the middle of the leaderboard after getting 35 and 39 for her routines which gave her a total score of 74. Although that wasn't enough to stop her from landing in the dance-off as she had to go head-to-head -head with actor Will Meller. Both being able to pick which of the two dances they wanted to perform again, Fleur and Vito chose their Charleston with Will and Nancy picking their couple's choice. However, the judges were divided as Craig Revel Horwood and Motsi Mobuse opted to save Fleur whereas Anton Dubeka opted for Will and Nancy. It all came down to head judge Shirley Ballas who had the final say, after confessing it was a hard decision, she saved Fleur and Nancy. The Strictly Come Dancing final airs Saturday on BBC One at 7.05pm.